Now y'all know when I come up with these big brain plays, I always gotta have a sip. Now we usually drink some, some fancy alcohol like Uncle Nearest or Johnny Walker Blue Label, but today we just got on some good old fashioned Jack Daniels to get my brain flowing to come up with these big brain plays for July, guys. I'm telling you, these stocks might fly through the roof. So let's go ahead and pull up just a little bit of Jack Daniels. Just a little bit. <laughs> yes, sir. And go ahead and take that sip. Uh, all right hey what's up youtube i'm zeke and welcome to the dream green show in this episode i'm bringing you guys two big brain plays on these two stocks that can outperform the s p 500 by the end of the year i'm telling you guys sometimes you got to think about these stocks and think about the market and how the market is moving so you could get in early so you could get these big gains of course you could just invest into these um voo and spy and just play the market and be safe and get these four to five percent gains per year or you could really dig into this market come up with these big brain plays and have over 12 14 20 percent gains in a single year and these two plays i'm bringing you guys today can have an absolutely advantage over the s p 500 over the market and outperform both of them in order to give us some profit so make sure you stick out to the entire video so you can understand completely what i'm talking about and you don't miss out on any information in this video so make sure that you guys go down hit that subscribe button and also hit that notification bell that helps out this channel more than you can even imagine by hitting that notification bell but before we dive into it this video is brought to you by webo sign up now by clicking the link down in the description and now all you have to do is deposit five dollars and now you can receive two free stocks valued up to eighteen hundred dollars guys by just depositing five dollars with your two free stocks you could keep them inside the platform and decide to use it or you could sell those two free stocks and withdraw all of your money it's literally free money so don't miss out on this opportunity i think the last day for this opportunity is july 20th so make sure you take full advantage of it now also this video is brought to you by coinbase that is by far the easiest way to buy and sell cryptocurrency but enough talking let's go ahead and dive into these two big brain plays Welcome back, dreamers. Here we are inside my Robinhood account right now. I'm sitting around $57,000. I am down almost a full percent today, down $574. So we know as the market is pulling back, it's been pulling back the last couple of days. And as the market is pulling back, I left the dollar cost average in and I like to buy the dip. So when I see the stock market on sale, I go in and pick up a couple of shares of my favorite companies. And two companies really caught my eye this week. The first one that we're gonna talk about is Levi's. Yes, the Levi company that makes all the jeans, shirts, skirts, the denim company, Levi. So let's pull up Levi's right quick. So here we are on Levi's, ticker symbol L-E-V-I. Um, also on the day, they're down 1.74%, but over the last year, over the last year alone, they're up 123.32% over just the last year, up $15. So they went all the way from um, $12 up to $27 in a single year. I'm gonna tell you guys why. We should have really thought about this during the pandemic, but now that we're thinking about it after the pandemic and we got some more information, this might still be a good buy even at $27. We could wait for the market to pull back some more, but over the last five years, they just went public in 2019. Um, they launched, did okay, pulled all the way back to $9 during the pandemic and shot all the way back up to $27, been up um, 123% in a year. Now they just had an earnings call and they beat their expectations on their last earnings call for Q2. They expected earnings was nine cents per share and the actual earnings was 23 cents per share, beating their expectation by a large margin, guys. In fact, on Robinhood, they have nine analysis saying that um, they have 100%, uh, nine out of nine analysis are saying um, Levi's is a buy, zero of them are saying just hold on to it, and zero of them are saying just sell. And the reason why is, oh, also they have a small dividend yield of 0.35%, but the reason why Levi is such a, a great buy is because during that earnings call, they actually mentioned that during the pandemic, they collected a whole bunch of information on people and that everyone either went up two belt sizes or down two belt sizes during the pandemic. So that goes to the jeans. So a lot of new people, so a lot of people are, are out there gonna have to buy some new jeans, including your boy himself, you know, went up two uh, belt sizes, two up, up two pan sizes. So a lot of people are gonna have to buy new jeans, either bigger or smaller. So 
that's the thing to do with the pandemic. Either you started working out and getting in shape or you just sat in the house and got a little fat like your boy. And now you got to go out there and buy some new jeans, guys. So that's why they earn this call. That's why they have actually had a great rebound during the pandemic because people have to go out there and buy new jeans, guys. Now, this is the big brain play on the first stock. Jeans come in a wave, guys, a wave in style. Like style changes every nine to 10 years they come out with a new style. So the first time Levi's had a big boom was doing the baggy jeans era. Everyone has the 501s, the 504s. They had the big old jeans, super baggy, twice the size of what they were supposed to be. Super baggy around the uh, legs, everything. I had them, you had them. Don't say you didn't have them because you had them. Now those jeans were selling out. You couldn't find them in stock. They was going. They went from around fifty dollars per pair of jeans all the way up to like seventy eight dollars per pair of jeans because of just how popular they were. Now after about nine years of baggy jeans, they switched over to um, high waist jeans for the women above the belly button. And then nine years later, they went below the belly button for jeans. That was the style. And then they went to skinny jeans. I know you guys know about the skinny jean wave. Um, everyone was talking about the kids wearing skinny jeans. Why are your jeans so tight? Why are your jeans so tight? Well, that's just the wave of jeans that come in about every nine years. And now that skinny jeans is on the cusp of that wave being over, the next wave is soon to come. And if you want to get in on that wave early before that wave even hits the streets and you pick up some Levi stock right now before, before the next wave of jeans come out, because like when the skinny jean wave came, those drove the price of Levi's all the way up, guys. I'm talking about everybody had to go out and buy some skinny jeans. I can't fit inside no skinny jeans so that really wasn't my wave i was like slim slim straight fit you know but i never went to skinny wave fit but those jeans were selling out so this is the big brain play yes levi is kind of high at 27 dollars 96 in fact over the last week they have been pulling back a little bit they're down 1.9 percent but even at this price let's say if we do get in at 27 or if it do pull all the way back to 25, 23, and we get in at that price before the next gene wave come, and every gene wave lasts around like nine to 10 years, if we get in early, we can have a big, large profit from investing into Levi jeans. So that is big brain play number one. Let me know what you think about this play down in the comment section. Is it a smart play or is it a dumb play? Drop that down in the comment section. I'm gonna try to read them all. All right, so the second big brain play is NVIDIA. Let's pull up NVIDIA right quick. Okay, here we are on NVIDIA. Right now, they're down 4%. Like I told you guys, the market is pulling back. In fact, over the last year, NVIDIA is up 81%. So they have had an amazing year. They're up um, $326 over the last year. In fact, over the last five years, they're up 1,309.52% over the last five years. So NVIDIA is a tech company. They make graphics cards. They make um, cloud storage but they specialize in computer and technology. So NVIDIA, the big, the big brain play on NVIDIA is just because their stock price is so high, all the way up to almost $800, up to $726. In fact, they had an all-time high of um, $827. They are having a stock split. For every one share you own of NVIDIA, you are gonna receive four shares after the 20th. Um, so it's the so the price of NVIDIA is gonna be divided by four. So it's gonna go from um, 7726 divided by four to $181. Now, does that change the value of NVIDIA? No, it doesn't change the value of NVIDIA at all. In fact, that is like you having $1 and you're gonna give me your $1, I'm gonna give you four quarters. So other than you just having one bill, now you have four quarters. Does it change that you have a dollar still in four quarters? It doesn't change the value of NVIDIA at all guys all it is is a stock split 41 now this is where the big brain play come in historically speaking whenever a stock has a successful stock split like 4 to 1 5 to 1 2 to 1 stock split they usually outperform the s p 500 by six percent so if you want to just invest into the market invest into the s p 500 and get your usual six to seven percent gains every single year well just looking at data stocks that have a successful um stock split like a four to one five to one three to one two to one they have um a successful stock split they outperform looking at the historic data they outperform the s p 500 by 67 percent 
Uh, the last stock splits that I talk about that I invested in was Apple. They outperformed the S&P 500 and Tesla had a stock split. They also outperformed the S&P 500. So I learned my lesson from investing into those two companies when they had a successful stock split. So Nvidia is gonna have another um, four to one stock split. I think coming up, they're gonna do a screenshot on the 20th, July 20th. And then I think soon after that, you will receive your 41 stock split. So I'm going to take, just looking at data and, and off his historical records, I'm going to invest into NVIDIA, expecting them to outperform the S&P 500 by six to 7% over the following year. So that's why that's just a, such a big brain play to me. And I'm actually already an investor into NVIDIA and I actually use their products by buying their graphics cards. So buying, investing to that company is really not such a big deal to me since I want them in my portfolio anyway. So now, now that I kinda expect them to outperform the S&P 500, this is gonna be another stock that I'm probably gonna go heavy in on very, very soon. So let me know what you think about NVIDIA down in the comment section, guys. And there we go, dreamers. That is my two big brand plays. The first one is Levi Jeans, which one are you more interested in to invest in? And then the second one is NVIDIA, the technology company. So we got a clothing company, then we got a technology company. Let me know which one is your favorite. If it's neither, go ahead and let me know down in the comment section. But before we go, guys, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. It helps out this video. Hit that subscribe and that notification bell. Also, don't forget to pick up your two free stocks before this deal end on Weeble by just depositing $5. Go ahead and get your two free stocks. But other than that, I'm Zeke, bringing you the Dream Green Show, and I'm out. Peace.